Hey, and welcome to a new video. Get ready to tackle fun challenges and test your skills. Let's get started. 2 times 6 equals what? Two times six equals 12. We have two boxes and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have two times six balls. This equals 12 balls. Five times one equals what? Five times one equals five. We have five boxes and each box has one colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have five times one balls. This equals five balls. Seven times six equals what? Seven times six equals 42. We have seven boxes and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have seven times six balls. This equals 42 balls. Five times four equals what? Five times four equals 20. We have five boxes and each box has four colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have five times four balls. This equals 20 balls. Two times nine equals what? Two times nine equals 18. We have two boxes and each box has nine colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have two times nine balls. This equals 18 balls. Five times eight equals what? Five times eight equals 40. We have five boxes and each box has eight colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have five times eight balls. This equals 40 balls. Eight times four equals what? Eight times four equals 32. We have eight boxes and each box has four colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have eight times four balls. This equals 32 balls. Four times two equals what? Four times two equals eight. We have four boxes and each box has two colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have four times two balls. This equals eight balls. 10 times eight equals what? 10 times 8 equals 80. 
We have 10 boxes, and each box has 8 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 10 times 8 balls. This equals 80 balls. 4 times 2 equals what? Four times two equals eight. We have four boxes, and each box has two colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have four times two balls. This equals eight balls. Four times one equals what? Four times one equals four. We have four boxes, and each box has one colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have four times one balls. This equals four balls. Seven times seven equals what? Seven times seven equals 49. We have seven boxes, and each box has seven colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have seven times seven balls. This equals 49 balls. Six times eight equals what? Six times eight equals 48. We have six boxes, and each box has eight colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have six times eight balls. This equals 48 balls. 10 times eight equals what? 10 times 8 equals 80. We have 10 boxes, and each box has 8 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 10 times 8 balls. This equals 80 balls. 10 times 5 equals what? 10 times 5 equals 50. We have 10 boxes, and each box has 5 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 10 times 5 balls. This equals 50 balls. 8 times 3 equals what? 8 times 3 equals 24. We have 8 boxes, and each box has 3 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 8 times 3 balls. This equals 24 balls. 8 times 1 equals what? 8 times 1 equals 8. We have 8 boxes, and each box has 1 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls in all the boxes together, you will have 8 times 1 balls. This equals 8 balls. 8 times 9 equals what? 8 times 9 equals 
72. We have 8 boxes, and each box has 9 colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls and all the boxes together, you will have 8 times 9 balls. This equals 72 balls. 3 times 6 equals what? Three times six equals 18. We have three boxes and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls and all the boxes together, you will have three times six balls. This equals 18 balls. Six times six equals what? Six times six equals 36. We have six boxes and each box has six colorful balls inside. If you count all the balls and all the boxes together, you will have six times six balls. This equals 36 balls.